Welcome home, dream girls. Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time here, I am a black man's dream, and this is a black man's dream fashion on this channel. Yes, on this channel. It's all about looking absolutely beautiful on a budget because I believe, yes, I believe everybody has the right to look and feel absolutely beautiful on a budget. If this is something you're interested in, I hope you will consider subscribing to the channel. Click on the subscription button and the notification button down below so that you will know each and every time the Dream Girls is here. And if there's anything you guys would like to see, anything you guys would like to know, anything, anything you would like to see me, stop doing comment down below because if you don't say, I don't know. Anyway, guys, today's video is a thrift store slash rainbow trial haul. Yes. Yes, ma'am. Some pieces that I picked up. The things that I did purchase from the thrift store, I will let you guys know the name of the brand. So maybe you guys can still find it on ThreadUp here on social media. And if you're not able to find the pieces, at least you would know how to style items that are similar to this. So anyway, guys, if you're interested, stay tuned. Let me show you guys how I styled it. Yes. Yes, ma'am. Right, you guys so let's see what it is that they have in store this is a beautiful t-shirt i absolutely love the graphics on it and they also have it in black this is really cute and the price is all right so let's swing over here and take a look at these Blouse right here, which is really nice. Let's see the cut of it. Uh, and the back is out. That's really cute. And look at the pants. The pants are nice. And they have it in different ones. Let's see if it's sold as a set. Uh, nope. The pants is $16.97. And the shirt is $14.97. Alright, so this outfit is really cute too. This isn't the first one that they had, but it is a different print. It is a little bit different. It's still really cute. They have it in blue. And they also have it in white. And let's see, is the back out? The back is out. And let's see if it's sold as a set. It's $16.97. And it is sold as a set. Goodwill and Rainbow. So we're gonna go ahead and get into the video. I got so many good items to show you guys. Let me see, which one should I start with first? All right, so the first item that I picked up from Goodwill was these beautiful leather sandals. I absolutely love the detail of the sandal. The heel is short. Once I started wearing heels, I haven't stopped. And, um. I love a heel about this high, two inch heel, not really high, very comfortable. You can run, walk, or jog in them. And this brand is um, Gianni Benny brand. I will also put it up on the screen. It is really, really nice. I did look online. You are able to look up this brand. You might be able to find this sandal. They sell this brand on eBay. Make sure you look it up if you like this shoe. This is really, really cute. I paid only $10 at Goodwill. It's really nice. Y'all ready? The next item that I picked up, this, I oh mean, I think every piece that I picked up is really cute. So just get used to me saying it. Anyway, guys, I picked up these shoes here from Goodwill. They are from Zara. They are satin black. And the heel is like a one inch heel. It's a little bit flatter. I, be, I believe um, the um, two inch heel is a lot more comfortable. But I will wear this with some baggy jeans. I think that this will be really cute with it. Or a skirt dragging the floor or a dress or something like that. And you just need something peeking from underneath the dress. These are like knife heels. 
you see how pointed they are make sure you guys are checking out the thrift store because they do have great great quality shoes look at these shoes look how beautiful these shoes are these shoes was ten dollars the shoes was ten dollars and the leather is very soft on the shoe really nice and the shoe is still in really good condition no scratch marks no nothing and i saw this exact shoe on ebay so make sure you guys are checking on social media to see if you guys can find these shoes online this particular shoe i saw on ebay for 25 dollars and the name of it is gianni benny and i will put the name on the screen so that you guys can see how to spell it and you can go and find this shoe in particular on ebay because i did want to at least see if you guys are able to find the brands online because i will be bringing to you guys a lot more thrifting videos but i wanted to make sure how is it that you guys can get the items that i picked up so this item in particular i did see on ebay and it was for 25 dollars. love this shoe really really sexy and i paid ten dollars for it all right so the next one i'm not sure what they call these type of shoes but they are very popular I picked these up and I think they're cute, but a little bit of a twist to them. See, these shoes you see a lot, right? If you know the com comment down below and tell me what's the style of these shoes, the name of the style of these shoes. They're very popular, but this one is a little bit different. And it I like the fact that it tied on the front. You can wear this with shorts, long skirts, really, really cute short skirts. You can wear these with anything. And look, again, the shoes look basically new. And I paid also $10 for these. And I can't really see the name. All of the detail of the shoe is still intact. They're very clean. I wiped them down with Lysol. You can sanitize the shoes. But yeah, you can get some great shoes from the thrift store. All right, so I'm going to try to go over the shoes in the background very quickly. Some of you guys expressed that you wanted to know more about the shoes. These shoes right here. I also purchased from the thrift store. They are really nice. The shoe, again, is in perfect condition. I love the buckle detail on the side. And I paid $20 for these. And also, these shoes here was purchased from the thrift store. They do lace up in the front and give you like this potato sack uh, look. When you pull this tight and you tie it around your leg, it gives like a potato sack look around your ankle. Again, the two-inch heel just enough for sex appeal and these shoes were ten dollars recently i picked up this bag from the same thrift store how ironic isn't that cute okay so let me put this shoe back i picked up this bag just recently to match those shoes i thought that this was really really cute very unique it's like a scroll at the top and then you can see through the bag and I got to see what it is I put in here. Really cute. Maybe a nice, you know, nice little detailed things that you would want to see that wouldn't look all, you know, jumbled and jumbled up. A nice brush. Maybe a cute little, um, because Rainbow do have like really cute, um, teddy bear polar. It's like the polo bear keychain with the sweat on it and with the glasses. Pick it up for the next video and show you guys just in case you haven't seen it, but Rainbow has some really cute keychains and stuff like that that I will um, get to put inside this bag. A nice brush set, something really cute and style it with these shoes right here. In the bag, I picked it up for $3. And you see the detailing of it? It's really nice. It's not dirty at all. All right. So the next thing that I picked up was these shoes right here. I also picked up from the thrift store. Perfect condition, a nice satin blue the bow is really cute and i'm not sure but i believe i paid uh ten dollars for this shoe also and this is the last shoe um this one was for for nine dollars that i picked up from the thrift store a couple of months ago and these shoes was actually in also inside mad rags that i found out this shoe actually came from mad rags all right, so hope that that answered your questions because I wasn't clear on what shoes it was that you guys wanted to see that you was asking about. And if it was this one down here, it is from H&M. This is a, the white one and also the black one. They're both from H&M. And this bag is from Rainbow. Featured this one in the previous haul video. Anyway, I hope that answered your question because I wasn't clear. So I just figured I would go over the things 
that I sold directly behind me. So moving right along, the next item that I picked up from the thrift store, I purchased this skirt right here in a previous haul. I believe it was $5 for this skirt. It looks like it's a Levi skirt, but it doesn't say because the brand is taken away from here and it's not on the inside. But you can always look at the skirts. Look at the wear and tear, the uniqueness of the skirt, and make sure you pick it up. I have another one that I purchased recently, but this one was a couple of months ago. I picked up this denim skirt. I didn't realize, make sure you guys are looking when you go thrifting, even though I probably would have still got this. But I did not realize the zipper was broke. I'm going to take this and get the zipper redone. $12. This is a polo skirt. I was happy to pay for it. It has this nice drawstring belt. Wash of the denim is really good. And then the style of it is really nice. I have to fix the zipper. That's fine. And plus, I'm going to get it taken up in the waist. So the next thing that I picked up from the thrift store, and I absolutely love, love, love this piece. I can almost say I couldn't be more satisfied, but the price would have made me more satisfied. But as far as the um the piece, I absolutely loved it. It was perfect. It was exactly what I had in mind, what I envisioned. Something that was full around the arms, but fit tight or, or close fit into the waist. And that came down enough to cover my bump. Because, you know, tights are not pants. It's something great for the summer. And it was absolutely perfect. So cute. I was hoping and praying that because this is a small medium that it didn't stretch. And then the letters look all disfigured and stuff like that. and Or the tights became too thin. It, it did not do that. It came out absolutely perfect. It do have a drawstring in the waist, but it's not a functioning drawstring. You guys see these tights, pick them up. All right, you guys, now that you've seen what I picked up from the thrift store and for rainbows, I hope it gave you some ideas seeing how I style the pieces. Again, if you don't see the exact piece, I did give you the names of the pieces. You can look them up. Anyway, guys, I hope you absolutely enjoyed the video. Comment down below. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you like the best. And if you would like to see more videos like this, also let me know in the comment section down below because I really do love thrifting.